Hey everybody, how's it going? John Boy back with another Minecraft video for you all today. And today we're focusing on Foolcraft, the new series that I started. I showed you the loop egg glitch and I did episode number one. Episode number two should be out shortly if it's not already up on my channel. But I've seen a lot of comments, uh, not on my videos, but other videos where people can't play the pack or their computer can't run the pack or they're getting like 20 FPS. And I figured there's no videos out there to show people how to fix this problem. So that's what I want to do for you all today. I want to help those people who maybe don't have one of these top end computers that can push, you know, a couple hundred FPS uh, into a place where they can actually play the game. So what you want to do, the very first thing you want to do is you want to go to your full craft that you have downloaded through the curse launcher, give it a right click and view the profile and it'll bring up this page. And actually I've already got this started. What you want to do is you want to go to profile options and right here uh, you'll see full craft and it'll say locked. And it says warning unlocking will allow you to make changes. You could corrupt your saves, blah 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 blah. What you want to do, uncheck that so it looks like this and hit OK. And the screen's going to change and you're going to see all these uh, green buttons where you can turn on and off uh, any mod in the game. Now this is also good to know how to do this because let's say you try to start the game and you get an error and it says you know that um, crafting tweaks keeps causing the area or crop dusting or fake blocks or something you can just go ahead and turn that off and then retry to load your world and the game may actually load and that way you can continue to play your world until the fix gets done but anyways that's for another video today we're worried about Optifine so what you want to do is after you do that go here to Optifine Oops bring that back up. You're going to go to optifine.net backslash downloads and it'll bring this page up. And since Fullcraft runs runs on version 1.10.2, that's what we want to download. Now I tried downloading and installing it with D7. It did not work. So what you want to do is you want to go here, optifine 1.10.2 HDUD6 and click download. It's going to bring you to an ad fly. It's only five seconds and most of the ads don't work anyways. So we go three, two, one. We click skip add. You get it right here. Download Optifine 110 2 HD jar. I say yes. I'm going to save this. Uh, I think I have a Optifine folder and click save, and it's going to download it. So as soon as it downloads, you're done. You can go ahead and close your internet browser, and you're going to come back to this page. Click these dots and click open folder. Now here you see in the full craft folder, if you come down, you're going to see mods, double click on that and open the mods up. Now the next thing you're going to want to do is go to the folder where you downloaded it or the place where you downloaded the Optifine. Take Optifine and just drag it right into the mods folder. That's it. You're done. Close that out. Close out your other one. Hit play. It'll bring up your launcher. Hit play again. takes a second to load it in and your your game should start to load now what I'm gonna do is I know you guys don't want to sit and wait for this so I'm gonna go ahead and cut this and I'll <coughs> pardon me and I'll come back once it's finished loading okay well this is just about done loading so let's go ahead and see and make sure that we got everything working here There we go, and your full craft loads. You can go in to uh, your single player world, start a new one, or if you've already started one, I'm going to go into my where I'm currently at in my YouTube one. Wait for our world to load. Do, 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 do. Whoa, that's a white screen. There it goes. <laughs> wow, that was bright. It does take a second when you first load in. Ooh, I need to eat something. Apparently I didn't eat before I got off last time. Okay, so if we hit escape, options, video, and you can see down here Optifine HDD6 Ultra is installed, and you got all the different settings you can go into. 
Now, there's multiple videos out there that tell you exactly how to set your shaders, how, or if you have them, or quality and performance and everything. So if you want to work with any of that kind of stuff, please go search a bunch of videos. There's no point in me making another one telling you how to set it up because every computer is different. Uh, you know, there there's a lot of people who know more about this than I do. But like I said, you can go in here, you can change, um, you know, your clear water or whatever. And a lot of the stuff, if you highlight uh, over top of it, it'll tell you um, what what it does Ooh, and I think I froze mine <laughs> so don't click connect to textures but anyways you guys see all these things are set up you can go ahead and find out for yourself uh, what settings work best for you I hope this video helped you out thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time bye